Oh, oh, oh. Don't put your mic on mute. Like, ever. Because you always freaking forget about it. Alright. I think, I think we're set. I think we're set. I got sound. I got mic. I got me. I got a map. I got a pen, and I got a glove. You cannot map unless you've got a glove. If you are drawing on paper with ink on, you do not have a glove, you're not doing it right. That's, those are just facts, man. I'm just here to help with the facts. Wait, oh, hold on a minute. No one can see me? Hold on. Oh! That was an intro. That was an intro. How does this work? Is this better? Is this a little better? You know. So, I was mapping off camera. And when I map off camera, I turn the camera off. There's all sorts of widgets and things I turn off. I just go big. I record the whole thing. I give it to Noble Dwarf and I go, there you go, boys. That's literally what I do. But I got so into mapping off camera, I was like, oh, better switch gears. And I completely forgot. So thank you, Jack, for pointing out that mistake. So I'm just going to sit here. I'm going to let someone else do the mapping. Where's Ola when I need her? And I'm going to um, wait for someone to finish this map for me. Yeah, Jack, maybe you better edit that one out on live stream there, boy. Okay. But seriously, I have been doing some work off camera right here. I kind of finished that quadrant of the city. Um, warehouses, docks, um, kind of going a little bit into a mini industrial area. You know, we've got power buildings, ski ball testing facility. Don't ask. And this is kind of the net result, and it helps blend, actually, I think, it helps blend into the slums. So I'm happy with the slums now. I was kind of irked because it was a very hard edge. So now it kind of just blends a little bit better in. So I'm really good with it. This, by the way, is trademarked. You can't use it. Now what I do want to do, um, and we're not going to do too much of this right now, okay? But just, I want to show a proof of concept here or consumed, is this smoke area. Let's bring that bad boy down in size. Whoa, 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 no, 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 not that much, not that much, I'm being inverted. Oh, no. GL, welcome to the stream. is she talking to? What is she doing? What is she smoking? These questions and more. What, what direction were we doing the smoke? I think we were doing something like this. Alright. So, I just want to introduce to you. Did we have a layer for this? I feel like we had a layer for this. Smoke. We did have a layer for this. Okay. I kind of want to do this type of thing. Huh? Like a little bit of grunge? What was that? Size 200. And an angle of... I don't know. Okay. So we'll do 200. Pushes a professional. Like, what if we did... Where's my other chimney? Right. Scout. Wow, what the hell did my Wacom tablet just do? Like, seriously, what was that? One click. All right, let's get rid of that. I feel like I need to send that to Wacom and go, dudes. It's not on there. All right, so why not here? Strange. Strange. I'm gonna do a little bit more of this. I'm actually having fun with this. 
we do this, we do 200. That is a big smoke cloud. That is a big smoke cloud. Holy crap, no, but I'm serious. Do you think, do you think my computer feels like... I'm clicking once. I'm clicking once. Look what it's doing. Like, how is that a thing? Feels like something's broken there. Oh yeah, I'm gonna send it to wake up. We gotta go dudes. How is that a thing? Maybe it's my mouse. Let's give it a minute. I, I actually, I wanna put it here. That's better. Alright, what else we got? What else we got? Give me some more smoke. Uh, oh, this, that's big. Yeah, that, that's kind of pissing me off. I kind of like the smoke. I really kind of like the smoke. Not when it does that. That's kind of pissing me off. But that... Yeah, I'm actually down with this. Oh. I do not want to buy another wake up tablet, but what the frick is this? Alright, let's do a bit more. Let's do a wake up a bit more. Every time it's doing that weird shape. Three. Uh, okay, no, no, I'll, I think I'll take it. I think I'll take it. I think I will take that. That is some nice smoke. Yeah, I think I'm okay with that. That's nice. Uh, you know what? We're doing smoke. It was not my plan tonight, but we're doing a little bit of smoke. Do a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And you know, we're, we're gonna do some of it here too. How are you, GL? How's life been treating you since the last time we spoke yesterday? Over here. I kind of feel like I want to do a bit more there. Okay. Experiment time. Experiment. We're doing white and we're doing a little bit of opacity on it. Yeah, we'll get rid of the bullshit like that. There we go. A little bit of this. Oh, uh, yeah. Actually, I kind of feel it. I kind of feel it. Do we have any more chimneys, sir? Do we really... Oh, we have one more chimney. We'll, we'll do... Oh, and then we've got the big boys. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, okay. We'll do that. Okay, so good with you.
currently installing LEDs in a display case. I am intrigued. What are the LEDs for? Don't say light. What are the display cases for? We got more chimneys here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, if we're gonna if we're gonna do smoke, if we're gonna do smoke. Let's do smoke. I'm okay with it. End of the map. We're gonna come back to do a little bit of detailing. And we might do like a, just a smoke trickling out in the breeze. But um, this this works for now. This works for now. Watching Psyche. What is Psyche? Oh, toy. Okay, what type of toys? I've got display cases right over there, my friend. Like, right over there. And a lot of miniatures. So, I, I get you. Don't worry about it. What's toys? You, you might find that I nerd out way more than you're comfortable with. Alright, let's do 200. Oh, oh, I still got the opacity on. We gotta get rid of that. We gotta get rid of that. One. Hey, Phantom Jen is here. Cave and Steven are making monsters tonight with the wizards. They're coming for you. Not sure. I, I know Cave and Steven are doing um, another show right now, Jen. Cool. I have not heard a psych. I have not. I gotta be honest with you, with the sheer volume of shows that are out there, like a lot of good shows like this is a good time to be alive for shows right i honestly i'm so behind i am so behind on shows can't keep up and it's not like i'm trying to be an elitist prick or anything like that I just literally i don't know when people have the time to watch them Right, there's another one. There's another one. Okay, got it. Oh, there's another one. I don't want to do the same shape. Let's do a different shape. And we will do you. There, watch. Watch this. Boom. Like, what is that about? What is that about? Don't think we have any chimneys on the other side. That's good. That's kind of that's kind of polluty. Right, what have we got over here? We have you, noise, and we have you. What else we got? I love this dockyard area. I love this dockyard area. Are these chimneys? Was I intending these to be chimneys? They look like chimneys. Alright. One. It seems to be when I do a new brush. What if it's my Photoshop? There it is. Let's take you back and then do this. Well, Jen, I love, I love Wizards of the Couch. You know that. I've given to them, and I've been on their show, and I watch their show. 45 minutes, I'm streaming. I'm doing my thing. So what is Psych? Give me the elevator speech version of Psych. Like, lie to me? I can tell you what lie to me is about, you know? Cancelled show. Sadness. Oh. That's gonna, that's gonna chat my ass real fast.
Alright, what's the word we got? Let's make sure we've got them all. Gotta catch them all. There's one. There's one. chimneys done. This guy is a whole bunch of chimneys coming up here. I feel like this guy right here needs some pollution. This guy needs to represent this. 200. Oh, I, apparently I did more than 200. There we go. Oh, big cloud. Okay, big cloud. Bigger cloud. There's Let's not do that. Let's do this. Yeah, okay. Now, now I'm actually going to come in with that little hint of white just to lighten all of this up a little bit. Alright, so what have we got about this psych thing? Oh, it's a movie? Spencer happens to possess some uncanny powers of observation thanks to his father, Henry, a former police officer who taught his son to remember even the smallest details of his surroundings. When Sean is accused of committing a crime that he actually solved, he convinces the cops that he's a psychic. Oh, interesting. And with the reluctant help of his best friend Gus, Sean starts solving cases for skeptical but, uh, skeptical but increasingly impressed police force. A fake psychic. But... He solves murders, just because he's super freaking smart and observant. That's cool. That's cool. Good, actually, that's pretty good. I'm okay with that. We'll do a little bit here, here. Where's where's the source for this? I I don't know. It's just pollution everywhere. Uh, yeah, where is the source for this? Like. There's a whole bunch of, like, smoke and shit. Oh, oh, it must be you. You polluting little bugger. Okay, you're good. You're good. You're good. did an electrical field in that area. I don't know what it is, but it's on the main road, so step careful, kids. Right. Let's hit save. It's funny. Okay, okay. I'm sure Jack has it on our list of things to watch. Hello, girly. What are you doing? Hey, what are you up to? 
Well, I said tonight that I was going to do the university, so I think that's what we're going to do. And I'm feeling, I'm feeling it needs big, bold colours that the rest of the city currently doesn't have. If I zoom out, there's a lot of blue, greys and browns in here. Odd spot of red. I'm feeling that we stick towards the red spectrum for all of the university buildings here. That's what I'm kind of feeling. ships in the harbour. Should draw some ships in the harbour. If I'm drawing smoke on a map, I should draw some ships in the harbour. But not tonight. Alright, let's do it. Let's see if we can get this done tonight. So for that, we want to switch this. There we go. To you. And we're going to come down. Not gold, not white. Do we do blue? Do we just slide into the blue? Because it would actually blend in with some of the buildings on here. Do we actually go almost with a stronger blue, grey? We'll, we'll highlight like that where we'll start to insinuate roof shapes. Do we do that? Instead of red? Maybe blue with some gold accents. Maybe, maybe, I think I've changed my mind. Oh, they're coming after you. Jen, it took me a while to catch on. As in, they're streaming after you. I was like, well, what did I do? Why did they come after me? I got ya. What did that take me, 20 freaking minutes? And on camera too. Wow, that's slow. Alright, so what about something like... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Something's off here. Something is definitely off. Um, desktop sensor? Let's do this. Let's just do it. Pen calibration. Alright, let's do you. Oh, I'm great! Feel something's wrong. Let's try this. Okay. Okay. A little bit more towards the blue. I thought all the monsters would compete in a game day. Oh, that'd be kind of cool. actually kind of cool. That would be an interesting show. And yeah, Jack, no two poop. What's that about? Like, literally. Thanks, Jack. Like, if Monday, Sunny Jim, you want someone doing a top-up for you, you, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta represent a little bit over here. We're gonna try this. We're gonna try this color. Thank you, darling. Love of my life. I follow my eye. Thank you, Jen. No problem. 
You got Jen one? I think I would. Oh, well, yes, she knows you would. Yeah, and I, you know, I might, and, well, they're, they're literally coming on, though, in, like, 30 minutes. I mean, that's really close to me, like, to literally just having started. So I might, I might stream for a little bit and then end, Jen. I don't want to end prematurely because, you know, Stephen is online. I want to finish my thing, too. proud of myself and next week is going to be more of the same oh well I don't know what happened to you sir but I do apologize let's just do you you know I don't think we need this at the moment my my profuse apologies sir seem to uh seem to have made a bit of a mess of that didn't we Never pass an entire bottle to me. Jack used to actually do um, movie nights. He used to go out to the local um, sort of indie cinema type of thing. And I used to be left at home, uh, at home mapping with a bottle of wine or two. And I would drink the little crap out of that. Or downstairs, downstairs, play computer games with a bottle of port. It's gone. It's gone. Thank you, darling. Fast to you. Morning, Miss J. Miss J, just so you know, I completed the harbour area. Did that off stream mostly. Added some smoke. Added some smoke as well over to the industrial area over here. So, I've decided for tonight what I want to get accomplished is this university university that's a word I'm looking for university have I got the right no there we go I need something was that hold on uh, 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 uh. okay so we'll come back to that we'll come back to that let this Fix my eraser. There we go. Just like that. And you're you're kind of doing this thing, which means probably a little bit of this. And I'm, I decided, Miss J, that I want to um, have the university kind of have mostly uniform colored roofs and I was really leaning towards red but I was like no let's stick with the slate gray the blue grays but make it more blue and so that, that and because it would kind of start to blend in with some of the blues around it and bridge I think some of the districts in that area I mean that's very similar to those blues in the top right there so that little corner will have this pretty damn blue grey uh, or yeah yeah blue grey I was gonna say blue slate but you know what I mean right, a little bit 
there. Uh, you know, this bush is a little large. Let, let's, let's throttle this guy back a little bit. And we're, we're definitely going to come in and do shapes here. This is the thing, so we got you. How you doing, Miss J? Anyway, how's life treating you? How are the projects? How's the house sitting? How's Australia? Uninstall my wake up and uninstall Photoshop and start from scratch. I don't want to lose my bushes though. I'll be really sad in my pants if I lose my bushes. So, says Miss Jane, internet stream speed. Mine is 720p60 source. And jumpy and due to his hell. But Caves is 180 source and barely any lag at all. I guess Cave wins, I don't know. My, my internet here, my streaming internet is fiber, so it's like a gig. It's like 600, 700 up. It's ridiculous. So, and my machine's pretty good. I don't know 
why there would be. I mean, I even, I mean, I even throttled back my video quality a little bit, right? So, so why would, why would that be worse? I guess Kate just beats me on something else. Let's do the other buildings in this area. I don't know where that comes from. I don't know where that comes from. I don't know what setting that is. I'm not even sure if I... That might even be a Twitch setting. I will look into that, young lady. I will look into it. Okay. Like, this weekend, I will take a look. It might be I'm running some kind of default, which is like, you know, just too much. You know, Twitch is made for gamers and stuff. I mean, clearly, we don't need that, do we? slide into our oranges a little bit here. Get a little bit of you too. Yeah, Mr. If, if you know where that is particularly set, I'll look at it right now, but otherwise I'll just look at it this weekend. Well, actually, before tomorrow night, because I'm actually planning on doing a whiskey and paint tomorrow night. You might actually see me streaming something other than maps. I'm just not sure, Miss J, where that's at. I'm not sure if that's in my Streamlabs OBS or if it's something in Twitch itself. I'm going to guess that it's in Streamlabs. I don't want to like, do it midstream. But I hear you, and I actually appreciate the feedback because um, no one else has mentioned it. Maybe that your actual slower internet over there was actually proved to be a bit of a godsend if it actually has highlighted this thing for the first time. question for the artist this is not a question this is not ask me anything so racial town map you haven't done that you want to you've asked me that question before what the hell is wrong with you 
I'm pretty sure we answered that one on a stream. I'm pretty sure we did already. something didn't I like say something crazy like I wouldn't even know how to approach the darn thing no let's do green like some kind of 3d underground city like if someone asked me to do a 3d underground city like that like, part of me would be, like, really scared, and I would be reticent to take on the project, but another part of me would be like, do it, do it. Edge Marion is here! Just in time, Edge! With the racist comments. Good to see you, Edge. Just for you, Edge, I will zoom out in a second. I just want to get these few buildings here done. I feel like I can do a select paint. I feel like I can, and I don't know why I'm resisting it. I was going to do some yellow highlights on those roofs. We're definitely going to do that. Installing all my software this weekend. Okay, da -da 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 -da. Yeah, oh, 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 oh. You, you, you get a little bit of log like this, you get a little bit of log like that. Yeah, I think that helps blend. Yeah, good. Oh, actually, I said I was going to zoom out. There we go. Zoomed, El Zoom A. Well, Edge Marion is never a disturbance, my friend. Never. It's always wonderful to have you in the chat. What say you, oh, Jack's being feisty. What say you about a subterranean Cthulhu Elf hive mind? Communal city with openings into a nether space for potential future RPG. Jack, sit down. Sit, sit the hell down. Actually, I would do it. I don't know. I don't even know how I would approach it, but I would do it. I would do it, and it would be fun. And I think I'd do a good job of it. But yeah, this is coming along, right, Edge? This is coming along. I'm going to zoom in just a little bit here. Um, but I've got a lot of favourite areas, and I think, honestly, this industrial area over here is one of them. With the mines over there. And the pollution in the water. I'm, I'm kind of, I, I'm really kind of down with this. Right down to the little statue right there. But I mean, it's like, 
And I haven't finished this area, we, we've got to do the groundwork, but... It's like, it's coming together. It's definitely coming together. Yeah. And this painting in a quilt-like manner, finish the section, finish the section, finish the section. It's actually, um, yeah, it's kind of fun. It's kind of fun. It's like I could always, on like Facebook, like post 40 pictures as a full story arc. And you'd be able to see the picture go, uh, like the city go from, that piece, 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 color, 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 until finished. Kind of cool. Yeah, uh, Phantom Gen, please do. Please do. Um, so, everyone, just so you know, uh, uh, you've seen me on the channel. Um, God damn it, Zach, with Zach and Skeeter. Skeeter and Zach have actually been on my channel. Skeeter several times. I love these guys. Their channel is awesome. Look at them up on YouTube. God damn it, Zach. Please hit them up with a follow. Jack is going to be on. God damn it, Zach. Next Monday, May 4th. And that's not by accident. When I told you that Jack can answer any question about Star Wars at all, I wasn't kidding. He's going to be on that show. I encourage you. We're all going to go there. We're going to ask Jack very difficult Star Wars questions. Thank you, guys. That's very, very kind. That's very kind. Honestly, I, I feel that... Nine tenths of what I do on a map is because of you. And I'm not bullshitting you, I'm not just blowing smoke up your ass. This is true. You come in the chat, you encourage me, you give me advice, you say, have you tried this, have you tried that? Many of you have been extremely pivotal, and many more of you have given me ideas, and it's just made me better and better and better. You have you, what about drawing this? What about drawing that? And I'm like, oh, I never thought of that. Let's do that. God damn it, Jack. God damn it, Jack. Jen, you have to make it happen. Please. Please. Now, they don't twitch it, so I don't think I can host this thing. Uh, Jen, did you post when this is happening? Like, I know it's next Monday, May 4th, but, like, give us some details. Like, what time? What channel? Where can they find this? Is it on YouTube?
gonna do some highlights. Let's do some highlights. Just on the main buildings. There we go, Phantom Gen, May 4th, 5 p.m. Pacific Time, 8 Central Time, no, that's 8 Eastern Time. I think it would be 7 Central. Uh, for a special guest, Jack, oh, God damn it, Zach, with hosts, Zach and Skeeterberg. And there's a YouTube link, please hit him up with a follow. It literally costs you nothing. Just to hit them up with a the follow. They're two of the most awesomest people on the planet ever. I'm going to look up the most controversial Star Wars subjects. And I am going to hit the channel with those. I, I, I aim to actually be the troll in the audience. They've got some decoration going on in this university. Right, let's do the ground. Oh, by the way, everyone, just as uh, everyone knows, even including the lurkers in the chat, Wizards of the Couch, four minutes time, are doing a Whose Monster Is It Anyway? It's hilarious fun. They've got Stephen McFarland. They've got um, Cape Geek Art. Go check them out. They're going to be creating monsters together, and they're insanely fun. At the end of this stream, in about 30 minutes' time, we, we can go over there anyway. But if you want to go over there before I just go, okay? Go watch them, because they're cool, cool, cool peeps. I'm just calling ground right now. Phantom Jen, you are in so many time zones so often I can't even begin to understand what your brain has to deal with for me I have to deal with three time zones and that's it alright let's, let's cover some ground let's do this thing let's see if we can get this area dialed the hell in This area definitely is going to be more grassy than the area to the south. This area, I tried to stick with the mud and the greys and the stone, right? This area, no, not so much. We might do a little bit more stone on the slopes here, but I want this area to be just fertile, just lovely, you know? There are students here, folks. Students.
So we do this in several layers. I come in typically with a fairly darker version of the color I'm shooting from. Then I'm going to come in with a pretty extreme opposite. But underneath. That's the trick. Underneath. Alright. Oh, got, got to do this. We're going to call it the hills too, but I'm going to do that last. Okay, so let's come down a layer. That was kind of a greeny grey. Let's... I'm going to stick with grey and I'm going to do some stamp and there's going to be a reason for that. Because each layer I colour, colours underneath the previous one, right? And I'm doing it almost with a spray brush. And so each layer bleeds through the layer above it. And so what I'm doing right now is I'm almost blocking off where I don't want the final color to bleed through. That's the trick. I'm blocking off. We're going to definitely colour paths, colour paths are going to be a little bit whiter, like a lot whiter. And then let's come down another layer. Zoom in. Okay. So I did a dark green, I did a light stone. Let's do a little bit of mud. Let's just see it. And a little bit of mud, but I'm going to slide it towards here, and I'm actually going to make it a little bit lighter. Okay. Again, we will lay it down. Now the reason for this is I'm going to start really lightening this sucker up again. I'm reserving, I'm reserving a bit of space for for mud. See that right there? That bled through. Then we're gonna we're gonna come back through. I think we're gonna we're gonna start bringing it back towards the green. That's what we're gonna be doing right here. But we've already reserved stone and mud. The dark green is gonna come in underneath us. And the, that, the mud and the stone will stay in place. That's what I love about this particular colour style that I do. Because like right now that looks like, okay, what the fuck ever. But let's come down a way. And let's hit it up with... Let's do green first. Not super dark. But a good green, like a strong green. Right, let's hit up the grass. Again, I'm doing this deeper down, so all of the colours that we've already coloured on there, they're going to stay. side of the water, uh, the road right now. Let's just stick in. Then we'll 
we'll do is we'll come back through and anywhere that we feel needs a little bit of lighting up, a little bit of touching up, we'll absolutely do that. Uh, I don't want to do that. Not on the main road. Not on the main road like that. Let's, let's color that in. There you can see the tan. The tan is still coming through. about the roads, we're going to touch them up. The, the roads will be the last thing we do. No, the roads and the hills will be the last thing we do. There you go, that's beginning to step down. And as a time check, we are going to stop the stream in about 20 minutes time. I'm probably going to go raid like the five of us. The um, Wizard of the Couch. Okay. is in this alleyway here I'm actually just going to come down right here hard with a lighter colour I'm like basically pure white at this point okay Alright Jen, no worries. Thank you for the update. Um Let's do hills. Let's do hills. I want it to be fertile, but at the same time. We're gonna pick out we're gonna pick out the highlights here. Um let's go small. Jed, you know you gave me like a bloody heart attack right there. Coloring, am I doing coloring? I'm doing coloring. I'm gonna, I feel like actually I need to do this. Alright, now what you can see I'm doing here is I'm accentuating the slope and anywhere facing towards the sun or the direction of light is getting this highlight. We're going to come back through and do the same with a low light, but on the other side, the noise. I'm going to zoom out here in a second, you're going to see what this is doing. You know, let's do you two. Let's do you two. You, you do not escape this, sir. No, you do not. We're actually going to do even a touch of pure white, pure white here. Uh, let's do a little bit of this. We're going softer here because this is going to be on the shadow side, right? See, 
A little bit of this. A little bit of this. But you, you're just a plop. I don't even know what you are. Okay. A little bit of, and if nothing else, it adds a little bit of texture to the grass. Now I'm going to really come in a lot darker. Green! Yeah, yeah, green. I could have told you that cleaning glass was a pain in the ass. I could have saved you a lot of heartache. I could have been green. Don't do that. Yeah, so green right now. Oh, I need to do some shadows. I definitely need to do some shadows on these buildings and these walls. That's what's going to make this a really freaking pop off the map. All right. My friend, what have you missed? You've missed all the things. We are close. We're close to... The university area actually being kind of done. We are definitely, definitely, definitely going to add some shadows on the other side. We are 100% going to do that. I just want to get like the core shadowing in on the actual hill elevations right there. Looking good. Thank you, GL. Thank you. And I look forward to seeing you post your pics too. Tag me in it, okay? Shadows. Um, okay, so. I'm going to do black, the layer is 20% opacity, so I'm not going to overthink this. We're going to do this, we're going to do a pretty big push. Get something like this. And here's why. Uh, no, we're going to go bigger, we're going to go 40. Go big, baby! Big! Because, I want to show that there is a big wall and building set. Down here. And I'm not going to do it on this side, but we are going to do it on the inside. There we go. And here. And I've already done the other uh, the side of the actual city itself. We're going to do a little bit here. There we go. And here. I want these buildings to feel grand, right? And the only way that they're going to feel grand is if they're putting this big drop shadow behind them. But then we're actually going to do a little bit on the hills themselves. Because it will help accentuate the elevation. Alright. I think that's good. Let's hit up the roads. Where are my roads? Roads. Now there we go. Path. I'm feeling it's not far off. I think we're going to bring in some white. I think we're going to do some white path here. Because 
Because I want it to feel clean, you know? Let's chase away, let's chase away all of the overgrowth on the side of the roads here. And you see we've already got our flagstones in there. There we go, underneath the bridge, underneath the bridge and out. to the path layer and we're going to give a little bit of a pale 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 yellow and then we're going to come in like this this these are the paths that are well trod right here This has like a stables. I feel like this is some kind of tavern right here. So we're gonna just add in the well trodden paths like so, right there. And now I think she is. Now, actually, 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 while we're at it, little paths. Little paths. Mm. Like meandering a little bit across the grass where the lovers are just sitting underneath a tree. There we go. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. And you're okay. Just, but but here, there's a little picnic area, something right here. And we've got a little bit of a pathway in this alley right here. And maybe even a little bit that comes off here. Now here, this is a prime example. Around you. And up to the steps. Yeah, I think that's it. I think that's it. Old Gator Games in the house. Been watching replays, but it's better to see the live stream. Hey, Old Gator, good to see you, my friend. You've joined us just about the time where we're actually going to go over to Wizards of the Couch. We're going to see what they're up to. They're doing a Whose Monster Is It Anyway with Cave Geek Art and Stephen McFarland. McFarland? McFarland? Stephen? That guy. Anyway, so we were going to go over there and see what they were up to. And they should have been streaming for about 20 minutes now. So we were going to check it. There you go, Jack. Get your brain picked, son. All right, let's do a quick recap. I am next streaming... For sure. Actually, let me rephrase this. Monday night, we are going to resume this map. And we are going to continue in a clockwise direction. But, 
tomorrow night you might see me pop online for a whiskey and paint. I have a new camera, top down. I'm gonna try and set myself up. I'm gonna try and be ready for it. If you don't see it happen, it's because I'm still setting things up, okay? Um, next week on Friday, I'm definitely doing a whiskey and paint. Um, but tomorrow I'm hoping to get like, you know, my everything set up for it. So you might see me pop up tomorrow. It will be mapping, it will be painting. Plenty of whiskey, plenty of painting. Then over the weekend, probably no streaming, okay? I have to get set up for Cobalt Car. If you see me pop up, it's because I got everything set up and I feel very comfortable. That might not happen. Definitely though, definitely Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of next week, we're coloring Light Harbor. Then Thursday, not sure if I'm doing Thursday on Cobalt Khan. Friday, I'm doing Whiskey and Paint at Cobalt Khan. I'm doing the Gary Khan Dragon. Saturday, I'm with Cave Geek, and we're doing a Who's Map Is It Anyway. Then Sunday, oh, Friday. Friday, actually, during the day, I'm running a Call of Cthulhu game. You're going to see me pop up during the day on Friday. Me running a game. Check that out. Then Sunday, Luke Gygax, Stephen Chenault, me, talking about Gax more. Busy week ahead. Busy week ahead. All right. So I'm, right now, I'm going to start a raid on Wizards of the Couch. Please stick around for this. If you've not seen them before, you need to see them. It's hilarious fun. Cave Geek and Steven input onto a monster that a very talented artist is drawing in real time. You get to say what that monster attributes and physical appearance should be and what his special skills are. So let's go over there and let's have your input, okay? It costs you nothing to go over there, hit them up with a follow, just check them out. And if you have seen them, come on, it's a no-brainer. Let's do this thing. Otherwise, I think I'm going to be back tomorrow with a little bit of whiskey and paint. I see you there. Until then, night everyone. I love you. Thanks for hanging out.